Hey guys, Dan the Medic here, welcome to the channel. Now today I'm over here in Brooklyn, New York City, where I'm inside this here Chong King Wharf hot pot. It's an all-you-can-eat place where, you know, you got soup boiling and a whole bunch of food. Yeah, let's check it out. So this place here has been open for about a year. I've never heard of it, but Tung, you, you remember Tung from all my other videos. My friend Tung, the chicken feet eater. Oh, as a matter of fact, I think he ordered chicken feet today. Believe it or not, he is quite proud of his chicken feet eating. Nothing wrong with that, guys. Nothing wrong with that. All right. So, I'm going to start off with my bowl of white rice. Chopsticks. Oh, by the way, the sauce bar and the drinks are included. Drinks such as this here, uh, soy milk type thing. Very Chinese, very Chinese guys. They're so Chinese, I don't even know how to open this. Ah. Oh, and it's a, like a foil cap. And you got this like a uh, beveled straw thing. It works. Very soy, very soy. All right, the first thing I'm going for is some of this beef. I assume it's beef. I don't know, tongue to order ordering. All right, so I have some of this here, beef. Let's give it a try in the spicy mala cooking broth. Oh my God, guys, it's so spicy. Whoa. Oh, Tung, can you please put the lobster tail in the in the hot side for me? Thank you, Tung. So I'm gonna put in some of my favorite stuff here. This is the uh, rice cake, and this is the fu chok, which is like a dry tofu skin. All right. Uh, sure, I, I, that way I can try your, your, uh... And from Tongue's non-spicy side, a piece of lobster. Let's give that a try too. Alright, so Tongue got the uh, chicken coconut uh, cooking liquid. And let's see how this tastes.
It tastes like soy, guys. So I fish the stuff out. It looks really spicy. Let's give it a try. So first, the rice cake. Pretty darn good. Very spicy, but darn good. Now some of the dry tofu skin. There's some good flavor here. This here's another type of beef. We'll give that a try as well. Spicy. All right, guys. So the stuff here is extremely spicy, but yet this place is not inexpensive. It is like. 55 bucks or something like that right now the reason it costs so much is because it's like they focus on seafood and if you got seafood a lot of times after you cook it you got to use your hands so if you use your hands with a spicy soup that's going to transfer it's going to get in your eyes so you got to be super careful if you're going to get the spicy mala that i got it burns guys it burns and they got and, and they gave me the mild so as it turns out, this is a feature that I was not aware of because the button for this feature was on Tang's side. And when I asked him earlier, he'd had, he, he said, oh, he, he didn't see anything. But anyway, this is the feature. The tray here is mechanized. So what you do, you put your food on it and then Tang will push the button and it dubs down. So I'm going to put the food on it and I'll demonstrate. Our tongue, push the button. Ain't that so cool, guys? That's just so cool. I'll have to admit, that feature alone is worth the price of admission. So I'm about halfway through and I'm liking it so far. It's pretty good. Now, uh, they do have a policy. It's a two people minimum. And uh, it's a two hour limit. So I'll put the relevant information into the pinned comment below. Listen, I have never seen a hot pot like offering that goes up and down before. You know, maybe like in China, there's a lot of it. And I just don't know because I don't go to China. Flights like. 30 hours or whatever really far guys so far all right so the stuff the tongue lowered is ready let's give these a try so first more of that beef with the fat on it Really good stuff, really good. Now this is the uh, little dumpling that has the fish eggs in it. We'll give that a try. Caution, maybe hot. Hot guys. Mm.
Got the fish eggs inside. And more of this here, tofu skin. It needs a little more time. Quail eggs, guys. I'll just take an additional. Thank you. May I have another bowl of white rice? Yeah, more rice. Thanks, Ada. All right. So now, quail eggs. Quails are like little chickens. So these here now are the oyster mushrooms. Mm. Good stuff, guys. Mm. So guys, a little bit about the food choices today. The menu comes in the form of a QR code. And because, you know, I use my phone to record, Tang did the ordering and uh, it ended up being like a whole table full of stuff that Tang likes. Well, alright guys, I'm gonna call this the end of the video. Everything I had here, fantastic. It's like eights and nines all around. Very tasty stuff. So, I'm going to put the relevant information in the pinned comment below. Thank you very much. And remember, New York City video every Tuesday. Thank you.